Well, I guess you can see why we're here. That and it's also in the title. So, we'll just fast track up there and we'll do a little bit of talking about these uh, ships. Sorry for the construction noises, they're getting their uh, parking lot done up. So these are actual ships that sailed or sunk in the Red River. The Kenora. I wonder if that was named after Kenora, the city in Ontario. I was born there, not on the ship, in the city. Chickamaw 2, Northland Lady Canadian. These things are huge. And I'm not going down there to walk around the ships because right now that would be considered trespassing. They are closed for the season and they don't want people walking around after hours. Yeah, right up there on that door. No trespassing after hours. So, yeah, I think I'd be considered trespassing if I walked on there. The MS Joe Simpson. I'm not gonna say it. I'm not gonna say it. Oh, they have some sort of shindig going down. I was here last week and this wasn't set up like this. Might be a private function. But yeah, these things are massive. You never really notice how big something is until you're up against it. Like, you see the ships on the lake and you think, yeah, they're not that big. <laughs> Guess again. Oh, cool. They have the they have the deck going, the uh, bridge going from one ship to the other. Yeah, that wasn't set up last time I was here. The Bradbury, the Pegwiss. Yeah, so that big white one must have been the Kenora. A little houseboat over there. Engines and other motor parts. I wonder if that white one over there was a lifeboat. Oh! Uh, old debuck, debuck, old defunct power station. I'm assuming anyway. Could be a dry dock. That could be a dry dock. It leads into the river. Possibly dry dock. Because there's something to go way up there. Yeah, not a defunct power station. Not a dry dock. Couple of guys enjoying life back, back there fishing. Something I haven't done in over 30 years. So, anywho, I think we're going to call it quits for today or for this episode. So that's it for this episode. Until next time, have a good one.